everybody welcome back to my channel i am maricel canoy if it's your first time please feel free to subscribe hit the notification bell so that you will be updated for my upcoming videos now what's up for today's vlog for today's vlog i would like to share to all my live streamer friends out there who would like to upgrade their live streaming so what do i mean by upgrade that is using a different background that are suitable also for your live streaming setup so earlier i had my live stream setup video which i showed you a small tour on and how much it cost now for today i would like to focus on how to use a green screen using that stream yard um, website in which i use for live streaming and uh, for today, I will uh, teach you how to do it step by step to, uh, to apply it on your own live streaming as well. So let's start. All right, so first and foremost, you needed to have a green screen. All right, so my green screen is from Elgato. This one cost 160 euros. Maybe you can check out also some cheaper ones, but I'm very, very satisfied with this one um the second one is you needed to have a better camera with me i'm really really satisfied with my sony uh, a6400 uh, camera because it provides me a better uh, resolution while on while i am on the live stream third one is you needed to upgrade your stream yard and it costs 25 dollars per month uh, that enables you to put backgrounds to put banners to put um uh, small clips video clips for your shout outs to your um subscribers or your super chatters or uh, to welcome your um viewers so that is one of the perks if you have an upgraded stream yard so i will teach you later how to apply it on StreamYard using the green screen. Also guys, you needed a PixArt application. So what does it do? The PixArt application or any uh, applications where you can create thumbnails guys is very useful because you can choose different uh, backgrounds that are already embedded in the app. So you can choose like summer, winter or any occasions that you have in mind just use your mind being creative and of course the last one but not the least is the better lighting you needed to have good lighting in the room so that you can portray a better image during live stream guys because the reason why um the green screen doesn't really work perfectly is because you don't have the very good lighting in the room and that is really one of the reason why a lot of live streamers when you look at their image guys it's kind of mixed with uh the person uh it's like that they are disappearing so that's one of the reason you know you really really need to have a better lighting so that it will work perfectly now i'm gonna show you how to put that on Streamyard, the green screen effect by using the images that i already save on my pixart downloaded to my laptop all right so this is my camera that i'm gonna turn on okay on all right so it's on already and this is my stream yard so what we're gonna do is i am going to go into my um stream all right so i already have here a uh, a green screen already so that's the image that i already saved but i will show you you go first to the setup the settings so here you can see the settings of the StreamYard, the green screen. All right. So when I here at first is none, there is nothing that you can see only the green, right? So I already uh, made, uh, I already save here um, 
backgrounds but i made another four in which i will show you so how to do that you just click the plus and then choose the pictures that you have made all right from pixart that you have also uploaded on your um laptop so i'm gonna choose this one so okay so this is now my new background okay so i'm gonna choose that one as my background you see and you can just adjust your camera so that you have this okay i'm gonna adjust my camera so that's it i can choose guys a lot of backgrounds you go to the setup uh, the green screen you can use this one all right you can use this really a lot guys so this is to give you an idea how to be more creative to level up to level up your quality of live streaming all right this one is my favorite so far because of the very colorful background and this one when i had my giveaways so so this is just a very simple way guys to you know to teach you to to level up a little bit your live streaming you can really do a lot of stuff guys for live streaming so let me go back to my favorite background all right so that's it remove and then you just return to your dashboard so that's it it's very easy right so that's it for today's vlog i hope that you like it you have learned from it and if you think that this video will help you guys, please like and share, comment below, and see you next time on my next vlog. Bye guys!